Hi everyone, welcome back to the Fragrance Direct YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to recreate this makeup look using Anna Sui Cosmetics. Anna Sui is one of the latest brands that's just become available on the Fragrance Direct website. They do some amazing cosmetics, so if you would like to see how I created this look and the products that I use to create it, please stay tuned. So first of all, as you can probably see, I've already got my foundation and concealer on and I have set it in place with the translucent powder. So the first product from Anna Sui that we're going to be trying out is the BB Pressed Powder. So this is one of the refills. The idea is you can order one of the palettes online and pop them in there. The colour that I have is in the shade 03. As you can see you get three different shades in the pan so my thinking is that I can use the lighter side and dust it all over my face and then bronze up a little bit with the darker side. So I'm going to go ahead and take an angle brush and take that darker side there and I'm going to work that into the contours of my cheeks. And as you can see, just as you build it up, it gives a nice natural contour, nothing too intense. And I'm actually going to take a larger brush and just swirl my brush in there, tap off the excess and apply that around my cheeks and on my forehead to give me a bit more of like a warm glow to the skin, just like that. And as you can see, it does just give a really nice natural glow to the skin. It doesn't look too obvious or anything like that. And obviously it sets your makeup in place nicely as well. Next up is another refill, which you can pop in a palette. And I really just cannot get over how beautiful these pans are. So this is one of the all over face colors, but obviously you can just go ahead and pick and choose a few colors and use them as a blush, which is what I'm gonna do. So I'm just gonna take my brush again and just apply that to the apples of the cheeks. For highlighter, I'm actually gonna go ahead and take one of the eye and face colors. This one here is in the shade A700, and as you can see, it's a really beautiful kind of champagne shimmer shade. I'll quickly just swatch it a little bit for you. These are so, so pigmented and incredibly buttery, as you might be able to see there. And I'm just gonna take my highlighter brush, tap off the excess, and apply that to the tops of my cheeks. And you can see that just gives a really nice subtle glow. I'm also going to take that on my finger and apply it to my cupid's bow. That makes a really, really beautiful cupid's bow highlight. I'm then going to go back in with that BB powder and again I'm going to take that darker shade on a fluffy brush and just work that into my crease just to give it a bit more definition. These powders are actually very misleading because looking at them, they don't really look like they'd show up on my skin that much. But when you apply them, they just give a really nice natural bronze effect. I'm then going to take another one of the eye and face colours. This one here is in the shade P800 and I'm going to apply that to a flat brush. And just pack that all over the lid. You could even use this one as a highlighter as well. So as you can see, in comparison to my other eye, it just kind of brightens the whole area a little bit. Next, I'm actually going to go ahead and take one of the multi-glitters. This one here is in the shade 800, and these are more of a cream product. They don't necessarily look like much, but when you swatch them, they give off this really, really nice glittery effect. Again, you could also use these as a highlighter as well. I think these work so, so well on the body. But what I'm actually going to do with this is take it on a smaller brush and apply it right on the inner corner. So I'm just taking this little brush, and I'm going to pick up some of the product and just apply that straight to the inner corner. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and tap that in with my finger just to blend it out. Next for lashes, I'm going to be using the Volume Film Mascara and I honestly just cannot get over how cute this packaging is. So inside you have quite a small one which really helps to get into your lash line. This applies inside bottom lashes as well and you can see it really does lengthen them. It almost gives them a dull eye effect. I'm then going to be filling in my brows using the eyebrow pencil in the shade 501. So as you can see here, on one side you have a spoolie and then on the other side you just give it a little twist and the nib comes out the top. So I'm just filling in mostly the front of my brow where I have a few sparse areas. And I'm also going to hire my arch a little bit as well. Last but not least, I have two different lip products that I want to share with you guys. So the first one is the Lip Rouge Pen in the shade 700. So this is what it looks like. Again, absolutely beautiful packaging. As you can see, this just has a little brush tip, which makes it easier to apply. And I'm just going to take that and dispense some of the product and then apply that to my lips. So this is what the Lip Rouge pen looks like. I'm honestly obsessed with this color. It's kind of like my everyday nude shade and it feels really, really comfortable on my lips as well. And then last but not least, I also wanted to share with you one of the more traditional lipstick bullets. This one here is in the shade 301. And again, I cannot get over the packaging with this. I mean, the lipstick itself, when you wind it up, as you can see, it even has a star shape engraved into it. It's honestly insane. So as you can see, this color in particular is like a nice pinky nude. It's kind of like a your lips, but better. Okay guys, so this is the finished look using some of my favorite products from Anna Sui. Let me know if you have any favorites in the comment section down below. As always, if you enjoyed this video, then please do give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you do want to see more. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next one.